Robots have become increasingly commonplace. They can help serve coffee. They can help restock shelves in stores. And now to make them even more responsive and adaptive, UK researchers are developing artificial skin that they say could have wide industrial use and can also help robots sense different types of touch. Here's a report. From filling in as baristas to being able to emote facial expressions, robots have undergone a massive transformation in recent years. And now scientists in Glasgow are working on creating artificial skin for robots. One that can make them sense pain and respond to different types of touch. Uh, the printed synaptic transistor that we have, they are able to learn over a period of time and that learning process is quite fast. So uh, unlike other versions of skin, uh, you have a over short period as well you have learning as well as over longer period you have learning. And with that learning, you are, uh, if, if you uh, link it with other sensory modalities, if you have to have a sensory fusion, uh, it is uh, likely that uh, it is, uh, that such an interaction will be much more effective than what we have today. This can be achieved with the help of synaptic transistors embedded in a robot, which can mimic the brain's ability to learn and register various sensations. They tested the skin on a robotic arm and the data is registered in the form of spiking signals. So in a sense, if you press the robotic hand with the same amount of force again and again over a period of time, robot now knows that, you know, it's kind of the similar uh, force that is being applied. And based on that, robot could react. So let's say if robot understands with time that, you know, this force is a comfortable force, it's a friendly shake hand, robot will uh, react like, like natural, you know, two friends meet. So that reflex would be according to that. But if it, it becomes robot, does it comes as a, as a surprise to robot that it has not learned, then it will react differently. Researchers say that the skin has wide industrial use. Even though there is still work to be done, the aim here is to mimic the way sensory neurons work. The skin developed here is constantly learning and may soon be able to adapt to and result in a new line of sophisticated and highly responsive robots. Bureau Report, We On, Wild is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.